In terms of the attendance today, um, you know, I know there's no official counts we do, but at least at this point, we've got to be looking at a record attendance today. I think the community recognizes this as really one of the premier events in the area, and actually in the Midwest. So I think the business community has been supporting, and I would encourage people, if they haven't, to think about it because it's wonderful. It benefits a lot of the merchants that are in the downtown area, pulls in people from all different directions. Their sponsorship has really been important to uh, the restoration of the uh, courthouse. I have a lot of other artists that were encouraging me to get out and do outdoor shows and they said this is one of the best in Indiana and in, in the Midwest and it is beautiful. It's a beautiful courthouse and we're having a beautiful day. The people have supported this fair like you wouldn't believe. I mean they had some super uh, years here that people would buy you know upwards of 10 pieces on a weekend which is a lot. Then they bought for the courthouse and so forth, and they have a heck of a collection that they've uh, come up with. And uh, I'm really proud to be a part of it, and uh, that's why I continue to do it. The Round Fountain Art Fair Committee does a wonderful job in, in helping to fund some of the art programs in um, our schools. The, the committee as a whole does things for the community all year round because of the money that they can generate for rent from around the fountain they can uh, put that back into the community and that's their whole desire to uh, create more art in our community. Well I know that there are a lot of ways that they could spend money. I think that they were very wise in my opinion um, in helping foster young artists at the high school level. The art community is strengthened by a fair. Uh, they, it's a really obvious thing when you come downtown. Not everyone who comes downtown is into art, but they will see it and they will come maybe look at it, uh, see all the people enjoying themselves. Um, and you strengthen the connections between people. Well, first of all, the obvious thing, I guess, is that there's a certain amount of income from selling paintings at the art show. Uh, but if you've done this since 1980, as I have done, you develop kind of a family out of town. You know, I have seen probably 50 or 60 people that have stopped by to talk to me before. Many of them own paintings and uh, many of them don't, but they come to enjoy the paintings of mine and other people as well. So I think that keeps me coming back. There's some positive feedback involved. Certainly our arts provide economic development and sometimes we don't understand how much that means to a community, but it really is very important to all of us that we uh, share, certainly in our arts community with all of these artists who come from far and near uh, and have a wonderful day here. And we're very proud of this art fair.